stepping up security. The next time you go to Great American Ballpark, you may be walking under and through some new machinery. Not on your sides, John Genovese joins us live at Great American Ballpark to explain what's going on. John. Yeah, this is probably the type of thing you expect to see at the airport, but beginning tomorrow, fans passing through the northwest gates here at Great American will now be required to pass through metal detectors. Take a look. You can see they're already installed and operational. We actually had the chance to see exactly how they'll work earlier today. Now, the MLB is requiring all gates at all ballparks to have these up and running by opening day of next year. We're told the main thing they're looking for here, firearms. Security staff say car keys won't typically set them off, but larger metal objects and cell phones will. Now, the, now the lights on the side of the units will actually indicate where something was detected, so security personnel have an idea of where and what to look for. Still, we wanted to know why the team decided to phase these in so late in the season. It's a head start. We have no information that's telling us we need to do this other than what I, you know, what we said before was just trying to get it, everybody prepared for next year. Because on opening day, we have to be fully implemented. And you know, that's such a great day for our club, for the city. And uh, we want to make sure that our fans can get into here as, as quickly and as efficiently as possible. And speaking of how quickly the team says on average, it takes about three seconds for someone to pass through those metal detectors so they don't anticipate this tacking on a lot of extra time for fans waiting in line. For now, reporting live, John Genovese, 9 on your side.